Is that better? All right, hello to all my pilgrims out there. Once again, I'm uh, coming at you from my humble home. Today, uh, I am doing a challenge, the baby food challenge, that I was challenged by my son. What's the challenge? I said baby food challenge. Well, what is it? Oh, I'm trying baby food. Um, I told my wife to get the worst baby food she could possibly try to find. And uh, well, let's see what she came up with. So the challenge is, I don't know what it's going to be until it's time. And so my son, what is it, Dr. Doctor Kid Plays? His uh, YouTube is Dr. Kid Plays with a Z, P L A Y Z. He challenged me to the baby food challenge. So here we go. Can it be that bad since your kid eats this every day? Yeah, so my kid eats this all the time. Um, not everything on here, I don't think, but let's see how bad it really is. Number one, what is this? Try it and see if you can tell me any of the flavors in there. It's It smells really bland. They're all going to be very bland. <laughs> it's baby food. I mean, it has like almost no smell at all. Let's see if it has taste. I, I, I don't even know. It kind of tastes like peaches. Nope, there is no fruit in this one. I don't even. Sweet potato and chicken dinner. Potato. <laughs> I would have never have guessed that. I sweet potato and chicken dinner. That's not what it tasted like. All right. Next up is okay. So I'll tell you what this looks like. For any of my Marine Corps buddies out there, you'll know what I'm talking about. It looks like Vegemite. It smells, it smells kind of like dirt. I think I know what that is. Can I guess? Mm -hmm. it tastes like pears. There's apple. No, it straight tastes like pears. It's not though. It's actually not bad. Apple and spinach with kale. There was a lot more flavor to this one than the other one. The other one was just like plain. You could barely taste. So that one, that was not too bad. All right. Next one up. What do you think that one is? Oh my God, it smells like shit. <laughs> <laughs> Don't say that. Ugh. Oh man. I mean like straight up, like this smells like the dog just pooped. I don't, oh, like burnt poop. Yeah. <laughs> what does burnt poop smell like? Burnt poop, and, and I do know what that smells like yeah, because I when I was in Iraq, I got to do it a few times, pour diesel in the poop and mix it up and it wasn't pretty, but burnt rubber? I hope this does not taste like it smells. <laughs> mm. Good luck. It does not taste as bad as it smells, but it isn't. He said, but it isn't. I'm going to say turkey and mashed potatoes. Why do you say potato like that? Yeah, why do you say potatoes like that? It's potato. It's just chicken. <laughs> it's just <laughs> Some burnt ass chicken. <laughs> Don't feed your kids this. I need that one looks like yogurt. This has no smell. Does that make you nervous? Yes. Why? Well, no. Maybe. What is that? I mean, I don't have that greatest sense of smell, but. That looks so nasty. I don't know. Not too bad. 
I would say turkey and mashed potatoes. No, it's ham. That does not taste like ham at all. I keep saying mashed potatoes, but I think it's because of the the texture that I'm thinking mashed potatoes. I don't know what a mashed potato is. You know, taters, like mashed up. Yeah, taters. But that was ham, and it tasted like turkey. Interesting. Interesting. All right, here we go. Next one up. This one has some stuff in it. All right, you see it? Right. It's got a little, little more texture to it. Kind of smells like maybe it's carrots or something like squash. Oh, this crunchy stuff doesn't do it any good. <laughs> I'm guessing carrots. But I don't want. Yeah. Okay, so that is carrot sweet potato pea with quinoa crisp. Quinoa crisp. Mm. Quinoa. Yeah, that one. Quinoa. Quinoa. Not, uh. I don't feed that to your kid. You say quinoa too? No. Oh. No. Oh. Wow. All right, here we go. We got some little wieners. Now, have we, we fed our, all our kids these. I mean, it smells like spam. We have spam. What's the texture like? Smushy. It's really like, it just like <laughs> dissolves in your mouth. I, there's not really much texture to it. It's like just gone. <laughs> it's just gone. Oh, he's going for more. This actually tastes... It kind of tastes like, like Spam, maybe. A little bit of a salty Spam flavor. Yeah. Not bad. I'll, I'll continue to feed my kids these. There's, there's not a lot of flavor. All right, this is the last one. Oh, uh, not a lot of flavor, but... That is chicken sticks. Okay, I probably would not have guessed chicken. <laughs> um, I, chicken I probably would have guessed, sticks? you know, like hot dog. Yeah, you want to try one? Ew, no. Tastes like hot dog. What? Kind of. Take that whole spoon. That's fruit. I can tell. <laughs> like a fruit melody. Fruit melody. I don't want to taste it. Oh. Not a red leaf. <laughs> oh. Yeah, not medley, melody. <laughs> I mean, like, initially, it's like, oh, sweet, yummy, got some chunks in it. Mm. And then it's like an aftertaste comes in, and it's like... Mm. Any idea what fruit is in there? Apple? Yes. There's three. Pear? No. Banana? Yes. Banana, apple, and... Strawberry. Yes. I didn't job. taste any of the strawberry. Um, but the apple, I oh, thought of because of the chunks. There, little bits. Uh, the banana, I get, I, it tasted like smashed up banana a little bit. So I got the apple and the banana. The, the strawberry, I would have never guessed. But, I, I mean, I, well, I guessed it. But All right, so that that's it? That's it. All right, so we did... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We oh. See how these taste. All right, so we did seven baby foods. Uh, I think only two or three of them were just disgusting. So here we have. We're gonna try the little crunchies, right? The little baby. The kids love them, you know. So they're basically they're like a little Cheeto almost. Um. It smells kind of like a Cheeto. You know, this is uh, what flavor? Mild cheddar. So yeah, it's kind of like a, kind of like a cross between a Cheeto and a Cheez It. All right. I mean, it dissolves so quick. It's like gone. Like. That's wider. 
Yeah. Wow. Yeah. So, I mean, these are these are good then. Yeah. I mean, it's got a little bit of a taste to it. Not a lot. But, I mean, it's gone. It like it just boom. It's dissolved. Boom. But as we have also found out that they have a very short lifespan once they're open. Once they're open, you literally, I, I, I probably wouldn't go more than a day or two. Um, and they start to go stale and they don't dissolve as quick, which can be a choking hazard. So if you are going to get these for your kid, just know that once, once, once they've been opened up, don't go past a day or so. I think it says on there three days or something like that. Three days. But I, I wouldn't go past two days. Once you open them, if you go past two days, just throw them away because they are up. She's going to try them out. She loves these. Okay? Both of them. Both the little ones do. Um, so, yeah, they, it can be a choking hazard, so be careful. She's going back for more. <laughs> Alright, so this is Proud America USMC coming at you. Also, I got the challenge for 150 coming up. I'm at 113 right now. So when I hit 150, I will be doing getting shot with paintballs in my backyard. So I haven't worked out all the details of that quite yet, but 150, so I need 37 more and, and we will be getting there. So help me get there. And then, of course, we also have the 200. Uh, I will be getting tased. So baby food challenge by my son. I accepted. I, I did all right. All right. I think there was only one that was just disgusting. And you shouldn't feed your kid that one. So it's Proud America signing off. Subscribe. Like. Share. Smash that notification button. I? America.